here, everybody here, and and everybody that's 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 not in jail and is using marijuana has an obligation to speak up and to change these laws so that not one person, not one person in the United States is in prison for using a harmless herb. Tomorrow is uh, the annual Hemp Day Freedom Rally on the Boston Common that's happening from noon to five. Thomas Jefferson, who said that hemp is a necessity for the wealth and protection of this country. George Washington, who said, sow the hemp plant everywhere. Basically, people that smoke marijuana live longer than people that don't smoke marijuana. Oh, yeah. Thanks a lot, y'all. Good afternoon. I understand this year you had a lot of problems getting permits and stuff. City officials were giving you a bit of a hassle. That's absolutely correct. They were trying to delay us at first and put us off, and then they tried to charge us for all kinds of police people that we don't think we need. We don't need cops. are very peaceful. No, and if there were cops required there, we would hope that... Uh, that the police uh, would bring them themselves instead of requiring the citizens to pay for them, which we thought was absolutely ridiculous. Uh, citizens actually, paying for cops they don't even want. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. The idea was uh, you're supposed to be, have freedom of expression, and we thought that meant freedom of expression, like free. <laughs> but they want us to pay. You have to pay for your expression in this town, huh? That's right. Yeah. And, and in fact, the uh, Civil Liberties Union lawyers tell us that uh, it's really illegal, that uh, we don't have to pay a dime for it. But uh, we just ended up negotiating a much reduced amount, and uh, so we're going to pay a little bit of extortion, but not nearly as much as we would have otherwise. Well, that's very good.
much committed to writing pro hemp songs to spread the word and to make public awareness. You know, let everybody know that you know this is a civil rights issue and a human rights issue and a lot of issues that you're hearing about right now. So grow it and legalize it. It's my motto.